Last year, the U.S. Postal Service had made plans to move all the mail processing and distribution centers in Casper and Cheyenne to cities like Denver, Colorado and Billings, Montana. Due to the rising issue with mail delivery times, Senator Cynthia Lummox successfully halted this plan until 2025. Just last week, on August 22nd, the U.S. Postal Service made an announcement that they aim to improve their processing and transportation times and claims that this will save the agency nearly $3 billion each year. Do you think it's going to improve delivery times? No. No? Not even close. Sandy Dent and Vicki Forwood were taking a walk through Lions Park this morning and say they rely on the mail for one thing in particular. Basically bills. Bills. Sandy is personally concerned about those who receive Social Security through the mail. Social Security, if you're expecting a check... That's that's serious stuff. Carby Kelly was heading into the public library this afternoon and says she has experienced mail issues out in Pine Bluffs. There have just been a few issues with, um, you know, sending mail out and then getting it immediately sent back and then also delayed times. Carby added those who experience financial issues from late delivery times should not be held accountable. If you ha have a bill that you didn't know a date for and you're waiting on the mail, I mean, it, you're responsible for it, but there's also a responsibility of the mail to get it in a speedy time. There will be an opportunity for the public to comment on this new plan on September 5th via Zoom. Full details can be found at yourwyominglink.com.